All right, so here's the tacking table in action, uh, or soon to be in action. What's uh, going on now is uh, this is how it powers up. Here's the control, and the uh, the mode LED is uh, flashing cold start. You can see that, uh, which gives the user the option by pressing the screen button. <coughs> To what Cold Start does is it actually bypasses these four heater controls and applies full on current to all four of these uh, tacking irons. And those are what actually heat and melt the plastic layers together. Um, <clears throat> Cold Start will stay engaged for three minutes and when it comes out of cold start mode um, it then defaults to whatever settings these are heat controls are set for um, and you can press this button to get out of cold start mode because we've already done this uh, we're already hot enough so we're just going to get moving right along and demonstrate how it works uh, the mode switch uh, setup mode press the green button to accept setup mode and when you press the green button once more the tack irons engage or approach rather then engage and squeeze press it again make some little release and that's pretty much the extent of setup mode operate mode pretty much does all that by itself and this one little knob here, the tack time, determines between a setting of one second all the way up to about 10 or 11 seconds. And for this particular test that I'm about to do, somewhere about halfway between five or six seconds with the heat control set at about 2.30 to 3 o'clock on the pointers. And I did all the artwork, I did all the labeling and uh, everything there is, is mine. All the uh, electronics and uh, working behind the scenes uh, is all my design. It's a PIC processor, microchip PIC working in the background. And um, so I'm going to put some plastic on and demonstrate how this thing will weld. So I have these plastic sheets here for uh, my customers. These are just scrap sections. They're like a like a two to five thousandths thick sheet. And this is somewhere around the neighborhood of twenty thousandths. And then another two to five thousandths thickness. <clears throat> just gonna put all that in under one tack side so you can see how it works. And then with this in operate mode, and I press the start button. And let's see what we have. Tack is still a little warm. It's best to actually let it cool for a couple of seconds before moving it, which is how this thing works on the machine, too. It actually gives it a about a three second window to cool down before the machine that this is going to be attached to uh, pulls it into the process and does anything else with it. But that is your that is your tack when it's all said and done. Everything's all layers are all stuck together. And from here I like to pick it up at the machine level when it's installed on the machine. We'll get another look at how the machine takes hold of it and processes the rest of it.
Yeah. 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 Yeah.